You guys ready to go to Maine? Yeah! Yeah! yeah. It's time for bed, guys. Bedtime, bedtime, bedtime. Go, go, go upstairs. Hey, you guys, come on out of there. We got the kids to bed, and it's been a very long day. But we're going to snuggle on the couch and go to bed at a reasonable time, and I'll see you guys in the morning. Well, good morning. We're on Parker Pond. This little lake has uh, salmon, trout, bass, a whole bunch of other things you can ice fish for. But I'm not sure if the ice is thick enough. It, we're gonna definitely gonna have to check the ice today. But I'm hungry, I'm gonna make some breakfast. Our first day in Maine and we're having a very southern breakfast. Biscuits and gravy. All right, it's time to find out how thick the ice is. Ah. Uh, Maybe two inches. It's two inches here. It might be okay out there, but I ain't gonna go out and find out. Oh, the paddle, you guys made the paddle. Should we get some dinner, guys? Yeah. A little sweet steak sauce here, locally made. Hey! So my sister and her family are joining us. You got waffles? And he's taking my pants off. Somebody mind grabbing me. This little guy's all partied out, so I'm gonna go take him to bed. And I'll see you guys in the morning. You guys ready to go on a little bit of an adventure? Yeah! Alright, let's go! Okay. All right, guys, got the whole crew here, and we're gonna go on a ferry to a little island, and uh, we're gonna do a little wintertime beach combing. So, we're gonna give that a go. <laughs> absolutely loves fairies in all shapes and forms. I do, I love fairies. Being married so nice, you go from trying to figure out what women want to only having to figure out what one woman wants. It makes life so much simpler. searching for sea glass, which is broken glass that gets washed up in the sea and polished. How do you guys just broke it? This looks sea glass? Yeah, see, look, 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 oh yeah. Look at that. Nice. Nice. Lucy is taking this very seriously. What'd you find, Lucy? We're here at an old military fort that has a lighthouse and my wife, the only thing she loves more than fairies, lighthouses! <laughs> uh oh, I think we lost Jacob. Oh. 
Well, I better eat up well because tomorrow is supposed to be a low of eight degrees Fahrenheit and me and Nathan are going camping without a tent. So I need to build up an extra layer of fat to survive tomorrow night on top of the current layer. <laughs> well, me and Nathan are heading to Flume Gorge in the Franconia Notch State Park area in the White Mountains of New Hampshire, which is not that far away. It's only about an hour drive. All right, buddy, we're here. Nathan, is this cool? Yeah. Oh, we need to find a little cave like that, but one without water going through it. Whee! It's been fun, but it's time to leave the trail behind. Oh, I see a big rock. We could build a shelter up against this rock. We'd have water nearby. Yeah, look at that. That's pretty cozy. Yeah, it wouldn't take much to build a nice spot. Hi, Daddy. Hi, bud. Do we camp here? Oh. It's a little lumpy, I'm not gonna lie. But it's better than most. All right. That'll keep the chimney from melting the tarp right there. We're gonna need to get a lot of firewood. Luckily, there's a lot of dead wood around. Ugh. That'll do. Well, it's getting dark quickly and the sun's about to set and I've spent the last three hours cutting firewood and I think I have plenty. But Nathan's been sleeping and taking a little bit of a nap, which makes me happy here. I'm gonna get the, the tent all warm and get some food made and I'll, I'm gonna wake him up. All right, I've got a cotton ball and I put some petroleum jelly on it and uh, we're gonna light this sucker on fire. And uh, it will light very well.
Hey, buddy, you have a good nap? Here we go. Let's grab it with the handle. It's it's hot. Just whatever you do, you cannot spill it in your bed. That tastes good, bud. Good. Yeah. Chicken teriyaki. There's my jam. That 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 tastes good. Mm. Oh. Yeah, be real careful. Uh, that's good hot chocolate? Yep, it's like no. So you're still hungry? Yeah. I have a snack bag for just such an issue. Now we have some Halloween candy. We have giant marshmallows, strawberry, and vanilla. Ooh. Oh, that feels nice. Well, it's only about seven o'clock and uh, Nathan had a pretty long nap. So I promised him we'd watch some TV shows on my phone and we're just gonna snuggle up all warm in our sleeping bags and hang out together for a little bit. I'm gonna keep this fire going and we'll see. It's supposed to get really cold tonight. It was a high in the 20s today and the low is probably gonna be in the single digits. Got a little bit of snow last night. <laughs> oh, Good to see smoke coming out of that thing. Oh, I really should have brought a pee bottle. I hate getting out to go to the bathroom. Oh, excuse me. All right, it's breakfast time. We got biscuits and gravy, freeze dried. Hey Nathan, you sleep well? Yeah. Good. Ooh. All right, we've got some breakfast marshmallows. What do you think, Nathan? Is that a perfect marshmallow? Yep. There you go, breakfast marshmallows. <laughs> firing your primary weapon, you weren't firing that hammer because you just can't pin him down. We got him flipped. You ready to get out of your sleeping bag and get dressed? <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm not in love with the idea of getting out of my sleeping bag. I am excited for the hike back though. We're not just gonna backtrack the way we came. We're gonna go a different route. And uh, we're gonna get a hike past a gorge and some waterfalls and see some pretty cool scenery. So I'm looking forward to that. But first, I need to get up and get packed. Ugh. Oh no, I stacked my boots up on my sleeping bag last night. Look what happened. Oh. <laughs> oh, I gotta go out there without shoes and go get them and dry them off. Gotta, gotta use my clown shoes. <laughs> Do, 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 do. Oh, that looks cold. Uh, it's taken down the tarp and the tarp fell onto the stove for just a second and burned a hole right in it. This was a fun campsite. This turned out a lot better than I expected. You ready, Nate? Yeah. Let's do it. I'll follow you. <laughs> I swear that backpack's bigger than you are, Nathan. 
You ready to go downhill, Nate? Yeah. Go! Ah! Ah! We're gonna die! Whoa! Oh, God! <laughs> I killed Nathan! Are you okay? Yeah. <laughs> You're still gonna go ahead and run downhill, yeah, even though you've crashed twice, aren't you? <laughs> we don't learn our lessons. We don't learn our lessons. <laughs> At least I didn't do that one. Oh, well, careful, you don't tear your pants. Whoa, look at that. Yeah, we, we gotta hike all the way around. Yeah, look at this. <laughs> you know, there's so many awesome hikes that get kind of ruined because they're too popular. But you come in the wintertime like this, oh, you get it all to yourself. It's just so nice. We're close to the end. Ugh. There's the car! We're here! Man, I was really worried about that being too cold. And that worked out really well. Though we melted our tarp, we might have to go to REI. Say it on the sign. It says survival camping, tactical gear, boots, and backpacks. Yeah. We'll get some army stuff. Yeah. Doggy, it fits me. Should we get this for Tommy and Jacob? Yeah. Oh. That's your army shirt, Jacob. Mm. Good to be home. Well, good morning. It's another beautiful day, and we've got some guests coming to visit. Zach Fowler with the YouTube channel Fowler's Makery and Mischief apparently lives nearby, and uh, he's going to pop over, uh, and uh, we're going to do some ice fishing right here at the property. Alrighty. You guys you like your pancakes? Yeah. Becca, this day is starting off so nice, isn't it? Oh, lovely. And the boys have been so well behaved and playing well together and... So quiet. Wait a minute. Who did this to you? Nathan! Nathan? Alright, I'm sorry to inform you, but Nathan will no longer be featured in any of our videos. Nathan, where are you? Luckily it was only a dry erase marker. Although Nathan was supposed to be using his dry erase marker for school, not to color on his brother. Mom did a good job. That dry erase marker came and off pretty good. And look at this. Hey, come on in. Hello. Burn it right off. <laughs> Got a wrap around and everything. Look at that, nice. Well, that's firmed up a lot. What? Oh yeah. What is that? Three, four inches? That's uh probably five. That's wicked solid. So Zach's got all the fancy schmancy electronics here. So he's got fish finders that allow him to put a sensor down the hole and look around and see if there's any fish around the hole. So this is this is my kind of fishing here. It's got a little structure right there, like weeds or something. Possibly, yeah. There you go. You can see the lead in the minnow right there. The orange thing's the lead and the little dot above it's the minnow. So we can see fish this big on the sonar. Sit on your bottom. Whee! Hard to, yeah, it's really hard. hard to get set. Go. go. <laughs> I'm winning. I'm winning. Ah. Oh. <laughs> While I was out getting the hot dog, Zach pulled up three perch. Look at that one. Ooh. There. Hey, I just got done in school. Yes. Yeah. I feel so. Oh, there he is. There he is, buddy. Woo. Just see it. Hey, hold that string, Tom. There you go. Your first main fish. 
Before he freezes. There you go. Oh. You just got a hit, buddy. Here. Reel this in just a little bit. Pop, pop, pop. Oh, see? There you go. Are you having fun? Yeah, you got one. I just really yeah, as fast as I can. Hey, slow it down, slow it down, slow it down. Oh, there, there you go. go. Sticking his gills slow. out. There you go. Oh. <laughs> All right, Tom, here's your hot dog. Some Chinese brats, and Tommy's got some cheddar hot dogs. We're, we're cooking up some good stuff. I wonder if it is just ground red short rib. <sighs> Gotta try these sweet Chinese brats here. Yeah. All right, we got some mango chutney here. <laughs> that looks good. It could be the hypothermia in my lips, but it does taste really, really good. Oh, there we go. Yeah, <laughs> little beastie. There we go, slightly larger than the minnows. Oh, all about freshening up the worm. Well, guys, we had a great time. We tore up the perch and ate a lot of good hot dogs, but uh, sunset, I think it's time to pack it up. Go find out what the kids are up to. Go back, I think the was. This. A slingshot. For you, me? Yes, you can pick. Do you want orange or black? This is the slingshot ammo. See, these are steel balls. The trapping yeah. card. It looks like a fishing hook. Hooks, sewing needle. Uh, that's a tick puller right there. And those are the trap triggers. You know, Mr. Fowler is a slingshot expert. You know that? The Fowler series, the Sparrow. Thank you very much, Zach. Yeah. I appreciate that. Now, in case you guys haven't done this already, make sure to check out Zach Fowler's channel. Fowler's Makery and Mischief. I'll put a link in the video description down below. So check that out for a lot of really cool survival videos. All right, I'll see you, Zach. All right, guys, you have a safe trip. We're going on another camping adventure tomorrow, so I think I better go to bed. See you guys in the morning. Well, good morning. We're just hanging out here, eating some breakfast and taking it easy. The boys have a little bit of school this morning, so I'm gonna use that time to pack and get ready for a camping trip. And as soon as Nathan is done with school, we're gonna go on another adventure. That's cool. Should we go see if we can find a way down there? Ah. Black. It's like a Look at this. There's like a whole cave behind that waterfall of ice. How's that one? This place is cool. Look at this. We're just right in the middle of this little canyon here. Look how clear this ice is. It's like crystal. You just see right through it. It's Nathan the Narwhal. Narwhal eating a bagel. Narwhal eating a bagel. Looking to mice. Looking to mice. Whoa. Yeah, but daddy, it's daddy. Come look at my Oh, this is slick. Oh, you want to come back here? Watch out, you get wet, buddy. Yeah. Yeah, look at this. Oh, this is slick. 
You're on the back side of an ice waterfall. Is that cool? See if I can do this without, without biting it. Hold on, Nate. Don't slip. All right, Nathan, I think this looks like an awesome spot. Oh, let's find some dead trees. I'm always super paranoid that I'm gonna run out of firewood in the middle of the night, and so I always end up gathering way more than I need. But I think I've got a good pile for right now. I think we need to get the shelter up. You want spaghetti or cup of noodle? All right, cup of noodle it is. Now you can boil water by putting a kettle on top of the stove, but it's not particularly fast. And Nathan's really hungry, so I busted out my little backup butane stove, which I always carry with me. And this thing will boil water pretty quick. All right. Nathan, are ramen noodles your favorite camping food? Yeah. Oh, some warm food feels good. Mm. Mm. Put cat whiskers and cat ears. You still hungry, buddy? Yeah. Well, here, we'll eat one of these little survival bars. I'm going to eat that. Well, we're getting ready to go to bed, and I have learned my lesson from previous winter camping trips. I brought a wide neck bottle. Yeah. <laughs> We're not getting out of our bag tonight. Good night, buddy. There's a lot of salt in ramen broth. You know how cold it's got to get to freeze that solid. Jeez. Got a thaw out my water bottle. Well, here on the Outdoor Boys channel, we post new videos every Saturday morning, and it's 7 a.m. on a Saturday morning. So I've got to walk out of this canyon to get enough cell service to be able to post my video. There we go. There's your new video. Whew, I'm going to go back by that fire. It's cold out here. My hands are frozen. Oh, it was cold last night. My bag was barely keeping it together. Hey, Nathan, were you warm? <laughs> Nathan's bag is so much better than mine. I gotta get one of those. Yeah, Nathan's got the Feather Friends Plover. It's a negative 25 bag. It's so sweet. And the best part is Feathered Friends will customize the length for you. And so I had them shorten it so it's a perfect Nathan size bag. You ready for some oatmeal, bud? As much as I hate to say it, I think I need to get dressed and get up and doing stuff. It is cold.
there's a lot of these really cool rock formations to explore around here and as soon as we get done breaking camp I want to go hike to a frozen waterfall and I think we might be able to find a cave as well so that's going to be kind of cool but first I need to get cleaned up. In case you're wondering how I secured the tarp to this rock face I just had these little wooden wedges that I jammed into the cracks right there and over on this side I tied it off to an icicle. Now we're going to get our tarp off without letting it touch the stove and get melted like I did last time. Well, this has been one of the coolest places I've ever camped, but uh, I think it's time to go explore some more stuff. You wanna go hike and see a cave and waterfall? Yeah. All right, let's drop our packs here so we don't have to carry them up. We'll come back for them, okay? We'll just stash them behind a tree over here. Oh, look at that. Look at that cave full of icicles. Yeah. Oh, look at this. This is cool. Oh, well, careful. Don't fall down here, bud. Yeah. Careful, buddy. Don't slip down there. There's a big creek down there. Whew. There was a small cave at the bottom of that ravine. But it looked like it had three feet of water in the bottom. I thought maybe the water would be frozen this time of year and we could get in it, but whew, I would hate to fall down that thing and be stuck in that water. Yeah, it's so pretty in the winter time. <laughs> Are you okay? Oh, the trail's getting a bit faint. Oh, this is pretty awesome, Nate. You glad we came here? Well, there's supposed to be a big waterfall around here too, but I'm not sure if we can find it. Are you crazy, man? You're taking your coat off? That boy's crazy. There we go, right where we left it. I'm so glad you came with me on this camp out, Nathan. Yeah. Did you have fun? Yeah. Let's go home and see mama and cousins. Hi. Hi. Smoky. <laughs> well, good morning and welcome to our last full day here in Maine. Mmm. Ah! Bye. Bye. Thanks for coming. Oh, it was fun having my sister and her family come visit. But uh, they're heading back. So Zach Fowler's daughter forgot her boots. And so we're going to go on a little road trip and go, uh, go see him at his place. Good angle. I think we're in the right place. Hello! Yeah. Ooh, we got the Lose Mach 2 here. We got the blow guns here. This is what we call survival deco. This is my kind of interior design here. Carving them in there, the days of the week. And then it's like at the top, that was my 10 items and a fish head for fish head soup. This is from the Duck Hunter 3000. It had a propeller on it when I was in Patagonia. It would... Look at that, man. That is a slingshot collection. All right. That was like third try. Dude, I appreciate it. <laughs> you got it. One, two. I was like, I gotta tell you, Zach makes a good looking pizza there. Yeah. Rectangle slices out of a round pizza. You're a madman, Zach. <laughs> and half marinara sauce, so you get this kind of. It's good pizza. <laughs> the rosemary on the pan. All right, kids, it's way past your bedtime. We had a ball. You guys come down to Virginia, we'll, we'll show you around. Definitely. All right. Oh, well, it's the morning of our last day here in Maine, and we're just cleaning up the rental house and eating some breakfast, and we're going to hit the road here real soon. We've had a really good time. Well, guys, did you have fun? Yeah! Yeah, that was a good time. Time to drive 11 hours back to Virginia. Yeah! Woo! 
Well guys, I hope you enjoyed this video as much as we enjoyed this trip. Don't forget to click subscribe to the Outdoor Boys YouTube channel and check out our travel and adventure playlist. And remember, we put out new videos every Saturday morning. So I'll see you then. Bye-bye. If you like this video, don't forget to check out the Outdoor Boys YouTube channel where we have hundreds of videos just like this. And don't forget to click subscribe so you can see other great videos every Saturday morning. And hit that bell button so you'll get notifications. Thanks for watching.